And the battle rages on. You got a big fight between these two. Come on, Dante, kick his ass. Come on, get him. Yeah, you know what he did. You know he deserves it. Uh, and here we got Nino. You know, watching from the sidelines from a distance. What am I doing wasting my time here? He's got this. Yeah, because he knows that Dante's got this. He he can win. It's it should be an easy uh, fight for him. You should not hey. underestimate this. Oh, game. oh, Shadow the Hedgehog. They put him in the game. Oh shit, that's oh my god, he's in the. All right, so Devil May Cry 5, the story starts off pretty simple. Basically, Nino over here used to be the owner of a very popular hotel, the Grand Nino. But then one day, Thanos left him a bad review on Yelp. Because of this, Nino is forced to retire from the hotel business for good. Now, Nino's pissed, and he decides to go kick Thanos' ass. Hey, jackass! Did your mother ever teach you it's not nice to- Leave bad reviews on Yelp. <laughs> Jesus! Holy shit, dude, that was only the first boss. Now, Dante over here, and yes, it is pronounced Dante. I know, I speak Italian. Dante knows that Nino's Hotel is a five-star establishment, so naturally, as a Yelp customer support specialist, he has to go punish Thanos for his falsified review. What the fuck? Nino and Shadow make a quick escape. Now, with Dante trapped in the Thanos tree, our two heroes must go kill the rest of the Yelp reviewers all by themselves. With the power of this robotic arm, I will defeat... Paul J from New Jersey! <laughs> oh, oh, Beth, you think the food smells weird? Maybe you should smell your own self! <laughs> Looks like you're gonna need an early checkout. Thanos, you sick son of a bitch. You might have permanently hurt my self-esteem, but you will never break my spirit. I will protect the rest of the hotel industry from your goons and their one-star reviews. I might not ever set foot in a hotel ever again, but that doesn't mean that I can't save my fellow workers. I mean, there's nothing wrong with Yelp as a concept. It's just, you know, some people abuse the system and that screws up the whole thing. See, look at this. Carol, you bitch. You didn't even put a reason. What the fuck's wrong with you? You know, at some point, it's not even a review anymore. It's just a personal vendetta. All right, you will never Yelp in this town down again, you absolute bastard. Die. Now excuse me, I have many more Yelpers to kill. Oh, whoa. Wait a second. That perfect Greek Ionic architecture. That statue in the center of what seems to be a porte cochere. This is a hotel. <gasps> a hotel overrun by ghouls. Die, you vile fiends. How dare you sully this establishment. This is no place for ghouls. It's a place for valet parking. This is a place of hospitality, not bloodshed. Now have at you. Taste my blade. Behold my epic style. The S stands for service industry. Meanwhile, elsewhere. Ha 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 ha, fools. Now it's my turn to fight. Now I shall slay the Yelp reviewers myself while not conforming to societal norms. And after this, I can go back to my job at the Hot Topic. <laughs> Perish before me, demons! Die! 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 Yeah, go get him, boys. Yeah, you're doing great. Now, as you can tell, Shadow the Hedgehog's a little different from Nino. You see, instead of fighting himself, he has these pets. Griffin and Sh Wait, what? Hey! This guy's panther is called Shadow. And it has a move called Hedgehog. What the fuck? This is Shadow the Hedgehog. Now, aside from his pets, he has this fucking mysterious book, which I'm guessing is probably some sort of mystical tome of ancient, powerful magics. <laughs> He's a cat that likes lasagna. <laughs> Hello? Hello? I beat the ghouls. Is anybody there? <sighs> the service is atrocious. I have no choice. I must take over myself. Welcome to the Nino Hotel 2. Will you be staying for dinner? Sir, sir, please calm down. There's no need for this. Ma'am, hey ma'am, can you control your husband, please? This behavior is highly uncouth. Sir, you can't be back here, all right? You just, you can't be back here, sir. I'm terribly sorry, sir. Maybe I can offer you a complimentary breakfast to make up for the stuff that, hey, 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 calm down. Calm down, sir. There's no need to be violent, okay? There's no need to be violent, you goddamn fucking guy. I'm gonna, fu I'm gonna hop the fucking, I'm, I don't make me, I wanna hop the fucking thing. I'm gonna just hop the fucking thing. Don't, calm down, sir. No need to be violent, sir. Calm down. Oh, Garfield, you card. Oh, shit. I'm a pretty cool guy. Uh, you know, I work at Hot Topic. I'm a cashier. I hate the rules and the establishment. 
uh, you know, pretty epic stuff. Uh, I do one weird thing. I like to read Garfield while I battle. Dude, watch this. This guy has the best move. Check it out. Et. Et. Ha! Oh! Wait, you... Did you see that? Look at how his hair turned white. This is Shadow the Hedgehog! And when you snap your hair white, you summon Big Goon! Ha <laughs> ha! Remember, only for emergencies. What are those, bats? Yep, emergency. Come on, go get him, boy. What is that, a plant root? Yep, emergency. Come on, goon, get him. Wh what the fuck are you doing over there? Oh, what is this, a little ghoul? Yeah, hold on a second. It's okay, man, just try your best. Oh, shit. Oh, dear, this hotel is appalling. Look at it, it's filthy. Well, no matter, I am a seasoned hotel owner. All right, I can sell anything. I shall make do and attract many customers from all across the land. Ah. The Master Suite. Time to do some business. Yes, gentlemen, welcome. This is our Master Suite. As you can tell, it's quite spectacular. I, I hope this room is uh, to your liking, gentlemen. I, I hope you will be staying with us for a while. It's, it's a quite good room. Uh, we have a uh, flat screen Toshiba television. Uh, we have some uh, couch and uh, we have a, a bed. It's great for bouncing and jumping upon, like so, so you can do that if you wish. Now, my only request is that if you do use this room, you do not leave a fake, a uh, false review on Yelp, because if you do that, then this is gonna happen, and then I'm gonna kill you right here, and then there's nothing you can do about it. I'll, I'll kill you in the room, and then your ghost can haunt the hotel and appreciate it forever! You know... Maybe it was my fault I got one-star reviews. Hello, sir. Welcome to our presidential suite. I hope it's to your liking. Uh, yes, there is a giant hole in the wall, and that is quite bad. However, I can guarantee that unlike our walls, our floors are the sturdiest in all the land. That was the floor's fault, not mine. Oh my god. This room is on fire! Oh! Oh! Sir, it's- the room is on fire! Sir, please back away from the fire! Get back! It back away from into the corner! Come on, away from the fire! Remember, guys, smoke detectors save lives. With just two AA batteries, you too can save a life like I am. Don't interrupt me while I'm reading my Garfield, man. I swear to God, if you interrupt me when I'm reading my Garfield, I'm, I swear to God, I'm gonna... So, Big Goon is probably the best character ever conceived. Ghouls? Oh no! I have to be oh, yeah. Damn it, Kayla, that's hardly a reason for a one star review! Hey, give it three stars if you didn't like one thing, or, or maybe even two, four or two or something. What is wrong with you? Why, why, why'd you do this, Kayla? What? In this mission, you can pick which character you want to play. Is it. Wait! This is Shadow the Hedgehog! Gentlemen, I am terribly sorry for the poor standards at this hotel. In order to make amends, please take this complimentary bottle of champagne, courtesy of me. Okay, I see you don't want the champagne. You know what? I'm, I'm better than this place. I'm better than this. this. This place sucks, okay? I'm leaving. Bloody Dreadful Hotel. Now, that, that was a one-star hotel back there, I tell you what. That, that was a one-star- oh. Oh, shit. Oh. What is this, the f falling car store? <laughs> no, it's not. I threw that car, for I am Giga Goth. Hello, my name's Nino. Oh shit, Nino? As in the owner of the Grand Nino Hotel? Oh yeah, that's me, dude. Aw, oh, dude, I really loved your hotel, man. Aw, oh, really? Aw, oh, yeah, it was great. The rooms were clean, the staff was super nice, and the food was fantastic. Oh, awesome. Whoa. <laughs> Why? Why? That doesn't make any sense! Why? So while Nino fights Gigagoth, Shadow the Hedgehog reveals that in order to defeat Thanos, he's gotta find Dante's dad's sword. Where's that damn Dante's dad's sword? So he goes on an epic quest where he ignores many societal norms. <laughs> I shall go up the down escalator! <laughs> I'm skating around and nobody can stop me! Nobody! <laughs> uh, oh shit. Oh, red light. Okay, I'll wait. Oh wait. I don't play by the rules. Finally, after a long journey, he finds the sword. And with it, Dante himself! 
He was alive the whole time, he was just taking a nap. Dante drinks the monster energy and wakes up. And then, after 10 years of waiting, you get to play as Dante! Ha <laughs> ha! He's pretty fun. Devil may cry. Now, Dante is a professional dancer turned Yelp customer support agent. He specializes in breakdancing and he's pretty good at it, however, as much as he loves dancing right now, he's got a reprimand Thanos for lying on Yelp, and he has to do so in compliance with Yelp customer support guidelines. Don't worry, all standard procedure, nothing to see here, just killing another liar, you son of a bitch, Clark. You think you can get away with this? Fuck you. These damn Yelpers taking a fine service and fucking it with false reviews. It's unforgivable. I gotta swiftly punish all of these people. I will use all my skills and intellect. With my power alone, I will accomplish my goal. I shall stay focused on my task and never falter. Is that a rocket launcher? Die. Behold the power of dance! Ha <laughs> ha! Have you ever seen these moves, ghouls? Behold my style, my power, my grace! Behold my moves! I have brought them down with the power of dance. Father would be proud. My father was a dancer and my mother was a hat maker, but you, sir, are dead and banned from Yelp forever. Ah, you know, sometimes I wonder what life would be like if I took after my father, pursued dancing instead of fighting. Perhaps, it might have been a better path to take. Perhaps, I should have- holy shit, is that a motorcycle that I can dual wield? I am no longer wondering- MOTORCYCLE KILL! Behold my motorcycle dance! It's like break dancing, but with a bike. More like bike dancing, they should call it. Ah, Giga Yelper, one of the biggest Yelpers known to man. Do not worry, I will simply follow standard procedure and drive my motorcycle straight into his ass. This is this is standard procedure, it's in the handbook. Uh, chapter 4, subsection ass. Imagine voluntarily breakdancing in a pool of human blood and then saying that you're bored. So then after that, actually major spoilers from here on out, so if you don't want that, just go ahead and leave. Basically, after this long, grueling journey, Dante ends up at his childhood home, the place where it all started, the genesis of this whole damn series. Then, after some brief introspection, he realizes the secret to beating Thanos. He must stab himself with his own sword. <laughs> But then, after he stabs himself, Dante transforms into Mega Dante, CEO of Yelp, a being of infinite power. Thanos, you son of a bitch, I've come to face you for real. Behold my infinite power. With this new form, I shall stop you and your internet goons from spreading lies. No longer will you use my platform to spread falsehoods. Yes, die, you bastard. Die! And now, to finish this in the way that I do best, with dance! Yes, Dante! Dance! Dance him to death! Yes! Father would be so proud! After Dante swiftly claims victory, Thanos retreats to a higher level of the Thanos tree. Meanwhile, Shadow the Hedgehog kills some white people. Then a chicken shows up. Mm, Shadow the Hedgehog, you fool! I will find you and then I will remaster Sonic 06. Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> what is this, the big chicken store? <laughs> Foolish chicken, my hotel contains one of the finest restaurants in all the land. You think I haven't dealt with your kind before? <laughs> oh yes, your tender meat will make for a fine addition to my room service menu. Mm, yes, I can see it now, my chef will prepare you with a fine creamy garlic sauce with some shallots and spicy potatoes for a bit of a kick. Oh, and speaking of kicks, DIE! Defeated by a mere human, how is this possible? Ah, ah, ah. Nino, thank you for saving me from the chicken. This war with Thanos has gone on long enough. I must swiftly end this so I can get back to my job at the Hot Topic. Please, take me to Thanos. Yeah, okay. Meanwhile, elsewhere... This is the best game I've ever purchased. Uh, the hat's an alright weapon. I mean, it's okay, but it's nothing special, you know? Honestly, I kinda like the other ones better. Is he- does he have a little hat after I threw it at him? Is that- did I do that? 
is really, it's the best weapon, honestly. It's no contest, really. Hee 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 hee! Ho! Shimona! Ha! Ho! Yahoo! Ho! Ow! Thanos, you bitch, I finally found you. Now explain to me, why are you lying about hotels online? Ha 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 ha! You fool, Dante. Don't you understand? Yelp has no real form of moderation, so I can post whatever kind of review I want. And if people only see negative reviews for hotels, then where will they stay? <gasps> no. Yes, Airbnb. A wonderful lodging application of which I am a major shareholder. And once I consume this Thanos fruit, I will be even more. <gasps> No! Snap into a Slim Jim, yeah! Ah, shit. He's molting. Now, Dante, behold my true form. Mega Thanos! Ha 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 ha! Come on! Face me once again! Ah, uh, take the fucking hat! Holy shit, it killed him. Oh, wow. Dante, we finally made it. Hey, fellas, check it out. I'm about to kill Thanos. Oh, wow, nice. Yeah, yep, you know, I'm just gonna go ahead and kill him so we can end this thing and move on with our lives. You know, I'm just gonna go ahead and- Wait. Please. Allow me to finish this. Uh... Well, I mean, I was just gonna, like, do it real fast. Like, it's no big deal, really. I can do it. I just- Oh, oh, he's going. All right, go ahead. Hello, Thanos. Shadow the Hedgehog. Thanos, you were a fool to lie about hotels. However... I've realized something. You know what I like more than a hotel? Someone's house. Can you see all of me? Capture you or set you free? I am all... I am all... of me. Oh fuck! Snap into a Slim Jim, yeah! Oh! Celestial Beam! What is happening? Oh, the reality has been shattered. Wait, is that... No, it couldn't be. What is it? Virgil. Turns out, Virgin was Thanos the whole time. Holy shit, is this Garfield? That's like my favorite comic. Virginia, you bastard! Oh! Ah, Dante. It's good to see you again, brother. However, as you stand now, you are as weak as your dancing skills. <gasps> Get stronger, Dante, and then face me. I shall be waiting at the top of the Thanos tree. Goodbye, Nino. Snap into a Slim Jim, yeah? Whoa, wait, so Thanos and Shadow the Hedgehog were both your brother the whole time? Yeah, pretty much. Woo. Woo! I gotta kill him. If he was Thanos, then he must have left the bad reviews. I gotta go get him. I gotta go- No, Nino, you can't do that. Why? Why can't I do that? Why can't Mr. I- Mr. Father! What the- Yes, it's true. I was Thanos and Shadow the Hedgehog at the same time. They combined to form me. And now I shall wait upon the Thanos tree for Dante to come face me. But first, he'll have to deal with my shadow goons! Ha <laughs> ha! You know, sometimes I wonder, that day, if our positions were switched, would our fates be different? Would I have your life and you mine? Virginia, you bastard! What the fuck? Dante, you're here already? What, didn't you have to fight my shadow goons? Oh yeah, I just gave them hats and they left. Woo! Oh, huh. Well, regardless, Dante, now that you're here, let's finish this once and for all. Indeed, brother. Come on. Let's dance. Woo! Brother! Brother, take the hat! Yes, look! Look at how handsome you look, brother! Mother would be so proud! Forgive me, mother, but I must slay this liar. He's too powerful to be kept alive. Indeed, I am too powerful, Dante. Ah, virgin, you've definitely gotten stronger. However, I know your weakness. Being ran over with a motorcycle, and then after I do that, I shall dance you to death! Ha <laughs> ha! Dance you to- Oh. Oh, shit. Oh! Ah! Damn it, brother! You've definitely gotten stronger. Indeed, as have you, brother. Brother, I'm sorry, but I can't possibly forgive you for lying on Yelp. Then don't forgive me, brother. Come on, 
Let us end this in one swift blow. I agree, brother. Come at me! Ah! Who the fuck earlier? Welcome to GameStop, we're going to pre-order Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. This is Matthew speaking. Oh, uh, hey, Matthew, listen, uh, I kind of need some exposition right now, so is it alright if I just do it right here on the phone? Uh, yeah, sure, I'm not doing anything right now, go for it. Right, um, well, you see, negative reviews are pretty common for any establishment. I mean, even the most popular places in the world are gonna have a couple of negative reviews, you know? And this whole time I was getting so hung up on my online reputation and how those reviews were gonna tarnish it. But I've realized something. Caring so much about how people view me online is pointless. I mean, if my hotel's good, then people will come. So, in the grand scheme of things, Yelp really doesn't matter. So are you sure you don't want, like, a game or anything? But right now, because of Yelp, my dad and my uncle are trying to kill each other. I have to tell them what I've realized. I have to tell them the truth. I have to tell them that while establishments all around the world put so much stock into how people reviewed them on Yelp, the truth is none of it matters. Because... Because Yelp is a load of shit. Ah, snap into a slim gym, yeah. Who the fuck? This fight ends here. <gasps> Nino! You see guys, while Yelp is a good idea on paper, in practice it's just a breeding ground for negative reviews. If someone had a positive experience, why would they bother going online to write about it? In the end, it's just a platform where shitty people can use the threat of bad press to extort free services from establishments. Holy shit, he's right! So, father, all your negative reviews don't matter. Because over time, people will lose their trust in Yelp, and start going to the places they like regardless of the online reviews. And furthermore, there's no reason why hotels and Airbnb can't coexist peacefully. Sometimes people want to stay in a hotel, sometimes they want to stay in a house. Really, it's not that complicated. So guys, at the end of the day, you don't have to kill each other. And I'm not gonna let you. <laughs> I disagree. Oh yeah, go ahead and stab me, Dad. Thanks for the fucking sword! <laughs> <clears throat> Alright, I see your point. Alright, cool. Now listen, the Thanos tree is expanding. If it keeps growing, it's gonna spoil the new Avengers movie for everyone. As much as I hate to admit it, it seems that you're right. Yup, guess we gotta go stop it then. Indeed. Let's do this, brother. Whoa, wait, where are you going? We have to go to Thanos Hell and kill the tree from there. Only then will it stop growing. Thanos Hell? But wait, if you go there, then you're gonna see a bunch of spoilers for the new Avengers movie. I can't let you do that. I, I can't let you guys go and see this. Yes, I know, Nino. It's okay. We'll just see it on DVD. It's all right, Nino. Stay here and create a utopia for both hotels and alternative lodging applications. Until we meet again, Nino. Goodbye. Oh! I won't lose next time. Hold on to that until then. See you later, alligator. Yeah, Garfield fucking sucks. Godspeed, you magnificent bastards. Well, all's well that ends well. Uh, except, you know, the fact that both my dad and my uncle are in hell. But other than that, it's great, you know? Yeah, sounds pretty nice. Yeah, alright, hold on, I gotta make a call. Welcome to GameStop, where you can pre-order Call of Duty. Hey, Matthew! Uh, oh, hey, are you the guy from earlier? Yeah, what's up, man? Look, I just wanted to thank you for all your help earlier, you know? I'm thinking of opening a new hotel, gonna call it the Nino Hotel 3. Huh? What do you think? Does that sound good? What oh, shit! Hey, will you slow down? You're crashing the car all over the place! What? Oh. Uh, hey, Matthew, I'm gonna have to call you back, alright? Listen, man, do you wanna buy Call of Duty or something? Seriously. So, you guys are being a bit unruly, huh? Well, fellas, sorry, but no running in the lobby!